talking about this um, EOS 80D Canon um, that I'm just sort of playing around with. Um, it's part of the Canon range, pretty decent camera to tell you the truth. It's got your sort of your normal features in terms of your aperture, manual, shutter speed. But what I quite like about this one is the fact that it's got a, um, you know, sort of a LCD screen, which is pretty cool. Um, so if I switch this camera on, okay, so if I switch it on, you can clearly see it's got an LCD screen. It's all touch screen as well, which is really, really cool. Um, which is really, really cool. Um, so if I just click on that one, for example, your screen comes on, my lens cap is on. So if I take that off, you can clearly see there is um, all your sort of parameters there. So if I click on ISO, you can sort of increase it and decrease it, which I quite like. Um, you've got your, um, if I go back, if I go back to that, you've got your aperture. And again, you can increase and decrease it. So you get a visual on screen in terms of the aperture um, on it as well. So if I click again, go back. You got your shutter speed, which is here, and again you can decrease your shutter speed. So if I take it to thirtieth of a second, you can see there's a visual on it here as well, um, which is really really cool. So for aperture, a shutter. So there's your shutter speed. Um, there's your aperture. You can increase and decrease it, and there's your um, ISO as well. And again, you can increase and decrease it. So for this camera, it's really cool because you get a visual like this. Um, you know all your features in terms of your your um, your settings are here as well and again you can sort of go to you know your menu over here as well click on that and go to your normal menu and sort of change those around here again it's all touch screen so if you want to raise images you know go back if you want to sort of click on that change like sort of the image quality you know if you should want to shoot it in raw or you shoot it in manual you know it's all touch screen which is really really good um, you know, so again, it's really, really cool in terms of all those features. Click on that. You got your, you know, your settings, your beep, your, your image stabilization and all that sort of stuff. Okay. Click on menu, takes you back to their info. So if you click on a, take a picture info, click on that, it gives you a histogram showing your visual image, a visual image of your film. You can zoom in as well, you know, zoom into an, um, an image, move it around, you know, so you got, you got that feature as well. Um, you know, you got your, your, um, you know, your sort of, if you click on your screen and you want something in focus, I really like it's very responsive, as you notice. So when you click on that, it's very responsive to where you're doing. Q button takes you back to white balance, F mode, one shot. So if you're shooting one shot, you continuous burst mode. And, you know, like like I said, it's very responsive. That I've noticed the touch screen is very, very good. Um, you've got AF selection over here. So you can click on that and change it. Um, you've got your, you know, your sort of, um, your hot shoe over here. You've got um, all your ISO, your drive over here. I'm using a Canon um, lens over here. Um, so that's pretty cool as well. Um, you know, you've got your image stabilization. Your camera is quite bulky. So if I hold it, it's got a little bit of depth to it. So I use a 7D, but this one I've noticed is very good as well. Um, but what I love about it, I have to admit, is this, this screen, you know, sort of in terms of clicking on that, changing your shutter speed, um, you know, like, and it's very responsive. So if you click on that, it will go back um, to where you are. You can tilt it as well, like this. Um, and you can sort of put it back in. So it's really, really good. Um, you know, it's, you know, it's quite a durable camera. I'll probably take this on a shoot. So Canon 80D, this particular model is. Um, and the key feature I would say is this LCD screen that I'm using. Thanks for watching guys. Any questions, please post via my channel. Um, just thought I'd make this quick video on this Canon ATD. Thank you for watching. See you later. Bye-bye.